if you get this error which says add-on push failed when you try to install or uninstall any streamio add-on then in this tutorial i will guide you on how to resolve this issue so watch this video till the end and you'll be able to solve this problem so listen to this very carefully now streamio add-on push failed as you see it here on the screenshot now why this occurs if the add-on is installed and working fine you don't need to worry about add-on push failed it's more of a developer side issue when pushing an add-on to the Streamio community library. If everything is running smoothly, you can just ignore the error. So if the add-on is installed and working fine, you don't need to worry about add-on push failed error message. It's more of a developer side issue when pushing an add-on to the Streamio community library. If everything is running smoothly, you can just ignore the error. However, if it's causing issues, then you can use this method to solve this problem. So but if it's causing issues, you can fix it by following the following steps. The first step you need to try is try removing add-ons you don't use before installing new ones. So try removing add-ons you don't use before installing new ones. Streamio does not have a strict add-on limit, but having too many add-ons can impact performance. So try removing add-ons you don't use before installing new ones. Now, if you do so, but you're still facing again the same issue, now try uninstalling every add-on except Cinemata cinemata then close the app then reopen it and try installing the needed add-ons one by one and see so try uninstalling every add-on except cinemata then close the app and reopen it and try installing the needed add-ons one by one and see if none of the above work then just reinstall streamio download the latest version from the official website which is this one which is streamio.com then after downloading the latest version, download the latest version from the official website, install it, and try adding the add-on again. So this is the best guide on how to fix this add-on push field. So if it doesn't cause any issues, you can just ignore it. If everything is running smoothly, you can just ignore the error. But if it's causing issues, just use the above methods which I have provided to you to solve this problem.